guys, welcome back to the channel. Just doing a little upgrade here on some spindle zerks. The originals are actually just pressed in there. So what I'm gonna do is just drill this hole out a little bit and I'm gonna go ahead and put in a new zerk fitting that is gonna be threaded. And these are just 5 16 So we'll just lock tight it in. Uh, first step is to obviously remove the old one and these have already been completely degreased and they're going to be powder coated and there's no type of grease or oil or anything in these that I'm going to have to deal with. So this will be easy to get out. I just take a little piece of blue shop towel and uh, just kind of fold it to where it's flat and then I tuck it down in there. And then the next step is to take a drill and just... Uh, drill the hole out just like that and you just want to and then the next step is to take a tap and then just go ahead and tap that out all right this actually had to modify the end of this one uh, the last time I did this. I did this on my uh, O2ZR800 spindles. So I just had to kind of take the point off of it. And that helped me to get down in there better. All right, you know it's bottomed out when you can't move the spindle itself. Let's go ahead and back it out. Um, the next thing I do is just to go ahead and hit with a file. And you have that paper down in there, so that'll help to stop any of this dust. Thank you. 
There you go. So that's what it'll end up as. What I will do though is put some Loctite around these threads, but at this point I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out, put a plug in there, and then powder coat these. So I'll show you what they look like when they're done. And just to show you real quick how I get the paper out, just gonna kind of move it around until it's uh, you know loosens up. Sometimes it'll even pop out with a little bit of air. Just get it kind of pushed off to one side. And you can either use like a small set of tweezers. All right. I got my, uh, my trusty $3 set here. That's it. Just figured I'd uh, show you guys how to do that real quick. Like I said, I'll go ahead and get these powder coated and show you what they look like. All right, they're done. The casserole is done. So we got these at a powder coating. There we go. That's it, people. All right, so if you guys aren't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. Hit the alert bell so you're notified of future updates. If you like this sort of thing, drop in, say hello, uh, leave a comment. If you guys know anybody else who likes this kind of stuff, please feel free to share in social networking and media. And we will see you guys in the next video, so come on back. <laughs>